something you haven't seen before we've started the process of taking the walls down this is the first side he's got to undo the barrel latches in each of the corners and then he just pulls down And there is pins in each of these corners. Trying to keep that in from falling is always a trick. And the last end. I am just not tall enough to help. So all I can do is try and hold that end stable while he folds the other end. And just like that, we're folded up. Now we just have to strap it down and finish loading it up. It's my laundry day and today we are using the Wonder Wash again. I got quite a few things in there, a couple pairs of shorts and about four tank tops, long sleeve shirt, Right now, we're just doing the spinning washing cycle. It's pretty easy, just go a little slow. We put two gallons of water in there, which in the clothes halfway up, and that covers all the clothes. And we also still use the little pods, the plastic pods, and let them put that in there. We're done spinning the clothes now, we're just draining out the wash water. And then we'll add in the rinse water. Now we're going to add another gallon. Another gallon is all it takes to rinse the clothes. Put, put the lid back on. You have to make sure that green thing is up. That creates the vacuum seal. Now all we have to do is spin and rinse. So we finished the spin cycle, it's draining out now, and he's helping me wring out my clothes so they dry a little faster. Uh, we'll put them, hang them up and you can see how many clothes we actually got into this little tiny wonder wash. Okay, so we've got one, two, three, four tank tops, a long sleeve shirt, two pairs of shorts, and two socks. I don't think you can see them in the uh, sun in the background there. All of that fit in that tiny little wonder wash. I have to thank my husband for helping me do the laundry. That's it. It's the wife signing off. Today's adventure is filling your own little green propane tanks. You have to have a connector to change it from the big tank to the little tank, an adapter. Kids, do not try this at home. I don't know if you can hear it moving. Get closer. How far will it fill up this way? Not very, because I don't have any way of pulling the valve.
because I might just have too much air in it. Yeah, I only put very, very little in there. I need to have some weight doing that. So what we really need to do is, if he'll stop moving, is pull that valve up so we can fill it up further. So he's hooking it up again, gonna turn the bottom valve on and see if we can get a little bit more in there. Cause it fills up with air. So you gotta push the air out to get the gas in, right? Huh? Fills up with air. Well, it's just got air in there. You can let the liquid in. Oh, yeah, you gotta push the air out and let the liquid in. Can't do that either, honey. I'm just trying to see if there's oh. any way I can get to that without my hemostats. I have those curved hemostats for this, but I can't get to them. Ooh, that stinks. Well, we'll see if it'll bite anything. Is the gas supposed to be on at the same time, or you just release the air and then... As air comes out, full thing goes in. I don't know if you can see, he's got a curved pair of needle nose pliers pulling that pin out that I showed you. So cold propane is. Tips are frozen! Fill that tank. Ooh, that is cold. That's probably gonna be enough for us. Here it's still going in. Can you hear it going in? I can't tell where the microphone is. I think this end. Hear me? No. So this is attempt number two. Sounds like it's going much better than the first attempt, which barely put enough propane in there to heat a cup of coffee. Since we cook with this too, we need more than that in a, in a can. And we only have a tiny propane heater, which I think our stove top thing, one, one pot, one burner. So we can't use the big one on that. We need the little ones. Plus we don't have enough space. Because a lot of times it's so windy we have to cook indoors. I'm going to pause this until it fills up. Like Sounds like it's just about done. So he's going to twist it off now. After he turns off the valve. Maybe. Upside down. <laughs> there you go. Woo. How's it feel? Up to there. All right. So, Good job. Totally full. Yay! We can have dinner tonight. A little too full, but it's full. Doesn't even shake. <laughs> Thanks for watching as we do it.